all right hello everyone and welcome back to my channel i know it's been a long time since i posted anything but uh just been busy had some health stuff come up and things around the house had to take care of then thanksgiving happened here in the u.s and just and i'm getting ready to switch internet service so all this time for the last out here in the country we haven't we don't have real fast internet we have about 100 megs down and 20 up and it takes a while to upload videos but that's about to change and uh, we'll talk about that in a second but if you remember right there is where my drake r8 went well my drake r8 i don't know a couple of months ago i don't know i don't remember if i made a video about it or not i haven't went back and looked but my Drake R8, it finally gave it up after 33 years of faithful service. I bought it brand new in, in the fall of 1991, along with my Alpha Delta antenna. Alpha Delta is still up after all these years, three decades. But the Drake finally gave it up, and it's an old, you know it's 33 years old, and I just decided not to have it fixed. So I just basically took the things off of it I wanted and sent it off for recycling, I guess you could say. But it's kind of sad to see it go. I've done a lot of good listening on that from 1991 up until it gave it up. So, But it will be missed. I do miss it. But over here, my ICOM 8600 and my RSPDX and airspy hf plus they they allow me to do so much more anyway so but i still miss the drake but speaking of the internet right over here is the wi-fi router and the service we have is called whisper internet now i live out here in the country on 40 acres of land and we're surrounded by over 2,000 acres of co-op farmland. Now, the little town I live just outside of Johnston City has a population of about 1,300 people. My hometown of Heron, which is about five miles west that way, has around 10,000 people. Small town. That's what I like. Small town guy. But just northwest of us, there's a little bitty town with about 200 people in it called Freeman Spur. And Freeman Spur, they have a, their water tower. And from my house, looking across the field, I can see this water tower. And Whisper Inter Internet has their equipment on top of that water tower. And in our yard, we have a little receiving and transmitting dish that goes back and forth to that water tower and the more people that are on it the slower it will get last three years i've been paying for 100 down and about 20 up 23 up somewhere around there and i'm lucky if i get 40 down because it's just you know out out here in freeman spur and the outskirts of heron and stuff where i live there was there was a lot of people on it. Well, three months ago, a local company started come in called Protec, P R O T E K, and they come and they've laid fiber internet all through our area and into town and all through these little small areas here, bringing high speed internet to us. And I've I signed up right when they were starting. So I'm going to be going from 50 megs down to a gigabyte down and a gigabyte up. So a thousand megs download, a thousand megs upload. So that's going to really, really help me uh, upload videos and stuff when I can think of something to do. Instead of taking two hours, two or two hours plus to upload a five or ten minute video i'll be able to do it in just a couple of minutes now with the fiber 
but today is Tuesday, December 3rd, 2024, and ProTech is coming out to install my, my fiber service uh, next Tuesday, which will be December 10th. And so I've got less, just under a week left with Whisper that I will call and cancel them. And I can't say anything bad about them because they, they did bring us some high speed inter internet out here in the country where nobody else would, would even try. And we've, we've had them for about three and a half years and they've been reliable. It hasn't went down much at all. It just, the speed varies wildly and so it's unreliable for speed consistency, but I can't see nothing bad about whisper and they, they've been good and you never know. I may need them again someday, but yeah, it's going to be a big change going from a, a Wi-Fi system to a dedicated fiber line. And I've already got my computer over here. I've got a Wi-Fi sit or a Wi-Fi seven card in it. I've got it all updated. I've got the uh, Cat eight Ethernet cable because I will be hooking the Ethernet. Got my monitors, but yeah, this I've got less than a week to go, and I'm I'm really excited, but I'm nervous too. But I it's really going to open up the internet and allow people in the, these smaller areas around here. And, you know, I do have neighbors, but they're, we're, you know, four and 500 feet apart or more, you know, eighth of a mile apart or whatever, and you know, a quarter, half mile apart between us. And it's really going to help us out, you know, than having to rely on, you know, this system. But yeah, I just wanted to kind of update you guys on uh, what's been going on and why I haven't posted a lot. And like I said, I don't post a lot because I do have some health issues I deal with from time to time. I've got a heart problem and sometimes I have to, you know, it gets, it acts up a little bit and it gets me down for two or three days. I just get really tired and and I don't feel like doing anything. And then I got to catch up on things. Plus my my little shack out here never really changes. The only change, like I said, is my Drake went out. So, you know, I, I, I don't have companies that send me radios to test or this and that. I'm not lucky enough to be picked to do that. So, you know, that's just the way it goes. But I did get... A new scanner. It's the Uniden SDS 200. Now, some of the stuff in this area is encrypted, you know, digital encryption. But these small little towns here in rural southern Illinois, some of them have gone digital, but they're not encrypted. So, I scanner for me is is still a pretty functional thing, you know, hospital, but I still get hospitals and fire and, and ambulance calls and, and bit local businesses and stuff. And it, it, it's got a nice display. I don't have my antenna on. I got my switch off right now, but it's, uh, you can, you can, I hook it to the computer and I just download the frequencies from radio reference and load them on here. I can set the range to go up to 50 miles from my house. And the display looks pretty nice. Because it scans. It was expensive as all hell. But, you know, you only live once. And that's probably the only scanner I'll ever, I'll ever need again. Because once everything starts switching, it'll be basically useless. So, But I did get that. And I do have, I don't think I've done a video about it, but I do have a, a outside disc on hooked to this for, for it's for um, 25 megahertz up to 1.2 gigahertz. And I've got it about 30 feet up in the air. So that really helps this out. I just have it on a switch right now. It's not on, but 
yeah, that's that's what's going on right now. So, like I said, I just wanted to update everyone. I mean, it doesn't really matter. My 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 channel's not that big a deal anyway, uh, according to YouTube. And I do appreciate everyone that watches my videos, and there's a few of you that. I know watch everything I post because you, you comment and I really appreciate that and I, I love it you know when you guys do comment at least it makes me feel like it's not all for nothing so and I do have I'm running my Facebook group now um, private Facebook group um, I, I kind of get busy with that sometimes but anyway rattled on long enough it's about time for me to turn in and everything but hopefully with this new fiber internet uh, maybe I can come up with something to upload a little more often or something like that but anyway can't believe it's December already it's just about three weeks away from Christmas Eve that's nuts and if I don't post a video before then I want to wish everyone that watches this a happy holiday season you know safe safe christmas safe new years and uh hopefully you'll get some radio stuff and uh so anyway take care everyone and i will see you on the next video whenever that is and we'll test out that new fiber system take care everyone